You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, YNR fans. It's Belinda from Soap Dirt, and I've got your Young and the Restless fall preview. These are official spoilers for the chillier months of fall that were issued directly from CBS. The Soap Magazine published them, and we're going to share just a few of them because not all of them to me were very interesting. As I've mentioned, since the writers have been on strike, even though the same head writer is working at YNR, the writing feels sloppier to me, and the writing of the spoilers is inaccurate, vague, weird, overblown, lots of things. Then we got saddled with that promo for last week where it showed Nick punching at him when it never went down for real on the show. Just a lot of frustrating things happening right now. And even though there is continuity to some extent in the writer's room, it kind of feels like chaos and madness over at YNR. And that combined with other times when it's just flat out boring. I don't know what you guys think, but I'm I'm tired of the business stuff being constant, constant and... Based on these previews I have for you, we got more to come. So the fall previews that I'm going to talk about relate to Sharon, Nick, and Sally, and then another to Victor and Victoria, and then Summer and Chance, and then Kyle and Audra, and last, Adam and Sally. We're going to dig into all these, but if you haven't already, please reach down, click subscribe so you don't miss any of our Young and the Restless updates, spoilers, and more. So the very first snippet from the fall preview is that Nick and Sharon are going to be working a lot of hours closely together. Sharon wants her company out of the merger and a spoiler for the week of September 4th has Victor saving Sharon. So maybe he's going to let her company go. I don't know, because the fall preview says Nick and Sharon work together to find their place in the corporate world. The spoiler goes on to say that Sally is frustrated when Nick's spending a lot of time with Sharon. And I think a lot of us wonder if them working so closely will result in Nick and Sharon crossing lines, especially given the next spoiler that I have for you that's official about Summer and Chance. So the second one is interesting because the wording of this spoiler for fall, it's intriguing and clearly intentional. And it says, Summer takes a chance on a new romance. And chance is put in quotes and spelled with a capital C like his name. We have talked about on this channel before about the vibe we noticed between Sharon and Chance. And I've gotten a fair amount of pushback from some people who are adamant that Chance is with Sharon. For those people that comment, I'm going to say this real quietly, not to upset you. People on soap operas cheat. They do it a lot and they do it all the freaking time. So if you are under some sort of impression that (laughs) Summer can't get with Chance because that would be cheating, then you need to think again. And here's what we've noticed about the vibe with Sharon and Chance and... (laughs) It just seems to be really about friendship that turned into backroom sex. I don't know. I just, I don't feel them. And it's not that I dislike either of the actors. It's just, I don't feel them as a couple. But with Sharon working so closely with Nick, that could drive a wedge between Sharon and Chance, and it could set the stage for a couple of recouplings. If Sharon and Chance are on the rocks, that leaves room for Summer and Chance. And that's good since Kyle shows no signs of stopping his shady affair. All right, our third one, speaking of Kyle, has to do with him. And it's about a Kyle and Audra fall spoiler. Kyle and Audra keep on playing with fire is what it says. And here's what that means to me. So this past week, Nikki told Audra she'd be her second in command at Newman Media so long as she's not still sleeping with Kyle. That is a very inappropriate order from Nikki as the boss. It is illegal to talk about your employees' sex lives. She shouldn't even be asking other people about them. She's breaking so many laws in her first actions as Newman Media CEO. That's all I'm going to say about it. That's real world stuff, and the soaps don't care about that. And then next week, Nikki calls Kyle over to the ranch and says the same thing. And he's going to lie and say, look, we already broke up. It was nothing serious. It was just casual and it's over. But Audra and Kyle have no plans to stop playing tonsil hockey or mattress dancing, whatever you want to call it. 
they are going to start sneaking around and that's going to add a bit of spice to their fling. But of course, eventually they'll be caught. And the big question is by who and what will be the fallout? We will have to wait and see. But as we go into fall, expect their affair to turn secret and sly just as it was when it began. Our fourth fall preview spoiler is about Victor and Victoria. These two have some worrisome dynamics at work. Victoria has been out of control for a while now, with her dad saying he's proud of her. While she's screwing over family, firing her brother, sexually harassing an underling, and... Lots more stuff. This Wednesday, September 6th, official spoilers say that Victor teaches Victoria a harsh les- harsh lesson. And then the week of 9-11, we see Victor making a tough call. So Victor already put Nikki in charge of Newman Media as CEO there. And it looks like Victor is probably going to retake the CEO seat at Newman Media or at least, I mean, at Newman Enterprises or at least co-CEO. Either way, Victoria is going to hate being pushed aside by her dad. Plus, Victor puts Nick back into the position she stripped from him. And that leaves us asking, what is going to happen to Nate? Since nobody but Victoria seems to like the guy. All right, before we dig into this last fall preview spoiler, which is about Adam and Sally, if you're enjoying this, please click a like, click subscribe if you haven't already. That really helps our channel and we appreciate it. And definitely drop your comments on what you're excited to see happen with these official fall spoilers. On to Adam and Sally. So once again, you know, Adam's family is shoving him aside and his frustration is front and center in fall previews for Young and the Restless. When Victor takes control of Newman Enterprises, it'll affect Adam, who finds himself cornered, basically. And then Nick starts spending a lot more time with Sharon, and Adam is going to take that opportunity to spend more time with Sally. This Newman shakeup could be the ticket to reuniting Adam and Sally. We will have to wait and see. Let me know which fall spoilers you're most excited about, just as a refresher. Vicky getting demoted, Summer and Chance happening, Nick and Sharon may Maybe happening, Kyle and Audra sneaking around, and Sally and Adam maybe getting closer to reuniting. Let us know what you're excited to see. Thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcast, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more. 